Working on some breaking news right now. We want to kick off our afternoon rush with that breaking news out of Hartford. A 71 year old woman is dead after being hit by a car that was leaving the scene of a shooting. This happened in the area of Garden and Westland Street. This is a story Eyewitness News was first to tell you about when we sent an alert through the Channel 3 app. We went on the scene all afternoon in Hartford's North End. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Matthew Campbell, he is live there now where the community is really rattled. Matt. Yeah, Aaron and Dennis, there is a pall of sadness over this community here. We've seen people hugging. We've seen people holding hands because while any shooting is sad, this one is different. A 71-year-old who's fondly known as the community's grandmother here is the unintended innocent target. Now, let's go ahead and show you the scene here on Westland. Please tell us at 1.30, two cars pulled up and exchanged gunfire. Now, as bullets were flying, the drivers of the car were trying to flee, and as they were getting away, one car, a silver Kia, struck this 71-year-old victim. Now, police were very close when this happened. They were just a block or two away, and they got here in seconds. One officer rushed to the side of this victim, where she was sadly pronounced dead. The silver Kia was found just a few driveways down, crashed into a building. Police right now are using their very uh, intricate uh, surveillance system to try to round up some of the suspects. And so far, they found a 17-year-old who was hiding and suffering from gunshot wounds. A 16-year-old was also taken into custody. Study that person's role in the shooting, that's still under investigation. Now, the second car involved in this shooting has also not been located, and right now there's no description either. Let's take a listen to the latest from police. At this time, we believe there was four people involved in the shooting, uh, two groups, mutual combatants. Uh, as one of the vehicles fled from the shooting scene, they struck a uh, pedestrian that was in the roadway. A uh, 71-year-old Hartford resident has since been declared deceased. So not only is this a uh, shooting investigation, uh, it is also a uh, motor vehicle fatality investigation. So, so again, tragedy on the streets of Hartford here. You can see this is still an active investigation into the death of this 71-year-old woman who, by all accounts, was just trying to cross the street. Now, much more coming up throughout this broadcast. But for now, that's the latest live here in Hartford. Matthew Campbell, Channel 3 News. Matthew, thank you. And of course, as always, we'll keep on top of this breaking news throughout the night. Stay with us both on air and online for the very newest information.